j'irai sur mon île. Mr. Step Bozo. I know that. Uh, Pepe Tommy. Pepe Tommy. Pepe You're Pepe mixing me up. <laughs> Pepe Tommy. I had a dream last night. Again? Yep. I was on this planet. There were gardens everywhere. The grass was so thick it looked like a Turkish carpet. Turquoise. It was black last time, wasn't it? No. That was another planet. On this one, I was so hot, Bozo. I could have melted on the spot. The moon was brighter than the sun. The sky was white. It had these plants. Looked like cactus. Boy, were they beautiful. Just unbelievable. The air was like a perfume. Plus, I wasn't alone. Were you with me? Mm-hmm. I was with you. <laughs> and the kid was there, too. And this girl. Oh, and she was really something. Oh, hey, my wife, maybe. Maybe. Anyhow, I didn't know her. 
Jeez, it was beautiful. It was like this combination of Ireland and Northern Japan with Arizona. It was paradise. Why don't I ever have dreams? Oh, you must. No, not That's even what impossible. I Bozo, if you didn't dream, you'd die. They tried it with a cat. If it started dreaming, they'd wake it up. Died of depression within a week. You have dreams, Bozo. You just don't remember them. Why wouldn't I remember them? You have dreams, kid? Do you? I think you'd better move, kid. Are you all here? One, two? We're sort of here, boss, and we're sort of not. <laughs> <laughs> okay, boys. <clears throat> all these, in two days. Are you nuts? There's enough there for a week. So you'll do a week's work in two days, on nights if you have to. Sears Fall sale starts Tuesday. The consumer can't be kept waiting. The economy depends on us to give each consumer his flyer. Learn to think big, like me, Steve, and you'll go far. Huh? All aboard. Come on. Hmm. My God, it must be nice in Siberia. All aboard? All aboard, all aboard, all aboard, all aboard. All aboard, kid. All aboard, all aboard. Hey, shut the door, bozo. Right. Whoops. Whoa! Oh, Christ, boss. You made me spill my coffee. A large coffee's 80 cents, and 80 cents is 40 flyers, and 40 flyers is 40 doors. You want to do my first 40 doors, boss? You're never happy, are you, Steve? Jeez, if I drive slow, you say you're losing money. I drive fast, you still bite my head off. Think positive, Steve. Think positive. The more I squeeze, the more I get. What? The more I squeeze, the more I get. <laughs> you know, Bozo, you're like a sponge. You're only happy when you're wet. <laughs> just like my wife, boss. What's like your wife? She just loves being wet. <laughs> you're no help to her there, I bet. <laughs> <laughs> Don't laugh, boss. You wouldn't last five minutes with my wife. What she got that's so special? Did you give her crabs or something? <laughs> no way. I try not to give the same gift twice. <laughs> <laughs> not bad, boss. <laughs> doing here. I need that money. You can't scrap this project now. It's unthinkable. I want that money now. Do you hear me? Lucas. I'm on the verge of a major Lucas. Breakthrough. A discovery that will revolutionize modern medicine. My program could show us how to exploit the full potential of the human I brain. Come, Cut off my funding and... Just to see you. <clears throat> Lucas, 80 years ago, this is where it all began. It was a two-bit lab under Dr. Wells. 
From it, we created the number one pharmaceutical conglomerate in America. Yes, because two-bit lab or not, Wells developed Renovore here. The headache remedy on which you built your number one conglomerate. And don't forget, Wells believed in research. And today, 5% of our budget still goes to research. That's no paltry sum. Then keep on funding my program. The old part of the lab gets used. Plus, the results I'm getting will yield major What profit. results? The few you revealed are not encouraging. Oh, and what of my, my brain-activated cure for the common cold? No points for that? Our primary goal here, Doctor, is to bring new medications out to the marketplace. Your remedy allows our customer to cure himself. Why do geniuses always have problems with their behavior? Brilliant, but over-emotional. Go wait outside. I said, go wait outside. Whatever doubts you may have had, having you transferred here was no demotion. This job has top priority. We need you more here than at headquarters. I have to find out what she's up to. Dr. Lucas is hiding something. There's something she isn't telling us. Whatever you do, don't let her out of your sight. We're counting on you. If you don't cover your route, the boss will probably fire you and Peckerhead won't be there to help you. So tell him to piss off. It'll do him good. How'd you like me to ram that stupid cap right down your throat? It's waiting. Come down and get it. Hey, asshole! You're just lucky I'm still in my stocking feet! Hey, shut up, you loser! I'm tired, and I've been up all night working for a living. I'm no welfare bum like you, and you want me! It's not my fault if you have to sleep during the day! Go plug your stupid ears if you... Oh! Son of a bitch, you cow! Quiet! You bunch of jerks! Here, Tinso! Catch! Oh, my God! I'm gonna... I'll get you all! Ah! Oh, you oh, idiot! I'm warning you! Come on! Do your word! Come on! I'm ready! Oh, shit! You're so stupid! Don't say much, do you, kid? Always quiet. Ashamed of what you're doing? Don't be. This job has its points. What other jobs leave you free to dream and use your mind while you work? Very few, and that kind of freedom has become a luxury. Freedom, huh? Absolutely. Some freedom, mediocrity is more like it. Think so, huh? I'd rather be poor and still my own man than a slave for some fat-ass boss in some corporation. You have a boss? Come on. He's no fat ass. He's all right. He's small potatoes. Oh, fair. You got it all wrong. Shift the biggest bunch to one side. Go on. Over here. Now we'll move this so you don't strain your back. There. Excuse me, boss. Hey, Bozo. Hmm? Look at that. He's helping the kid. Steve has some faults, but overall, he's not a bad guy. I used to be like that once. He really could go far. You like Steve a lot, don't you, boss, down deep inside? Oh, yeah, when he's not in the truck, he's perfect. 
He always has to have the last word. Uh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> you said it, that's true. <laughs> yeah, I sure did, uh, about a second ago. Huh? Well, I just said what you said I said about that's true. You were right. What'd you say? Well, I'm just saying after I said that's true, what oh, you said about Steve... Get to work and quit talking oh, like an boy. idiot. Sure, boss, but I was right. You're not here to dance. You're here to eat. Enjoy your half hour. I want to learn the cha-cha-cha. Surprise my wife on her birthday. Aha. Uh -huh. Come on, Steve. Be my partner. Uh, now, ask the boss. Boss? Hey, ask the kid. He won't want to. You'd do anything for your wife, huh, Bozo? When you're in love, add a boy. Hey, boss, how come we're taking our break down by the prison? What prison? We're taking our break down by the river. I did some time in there. Christ, did I envy guys passing out flyers then? What were you in for? Oh, I planted some bombs. Some bombs? Yep. Wanted to change the world. You? <laughs> you can't even change your socks. Boss, there are limits in life even a boss can't overstep. That's how the system's made. Give a guy power, the more there is, the more he wants. It's always been like that. He starts small and ends up becoming a monster. When that happens, you have to rise up and cut off the dragon's head before he swallows you. Me, boss, I blew up a munitions factory and three monuments. No injuries, just property damage. Oh, they caught up to me, but not till I'd opened their eyes. And I'll tell you, boss, I'd do it again tomorrow. Let me go, bloody thing. You know, you're lucky. A lot of employers wouldn't have given you another chance like I did. Oh, here we go. That system you mentioned? It works, son. Tell me where would borderline types like you be without the system? <laughs> oh, you can bitch about it all you like, but it's what keeps you going. Every penny you make, the system provides, Steve. Boss. I mean it. Every Bo penny boss, you make. Boss, you can't. You can't buy me, boss. Okay? Huh? You can't buy me. Listen to me. I'm an anarchist, not a parasite. I earn my money. Sure, sure. You can't buy me, boss. Understand? Hey, I got it. Huh? I got it. Steve, come here. Oh, I got it. Coming up. Okay, just a uh, minute. Okay, okay. Follow me. No, 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 no. Oh, no, Bozo. That's not no, it. No. <laughs> hey, move, Bozo. Look, look. And, and one, one, two, cha cha cha. And one, two, cha cha cha. And one, two, cha cha cha. 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 First, you urinate in there. Do not put in your sample till you're half done. Then, fill out this questionnaire. 
The toilets are down the corridor. On your left. Squeeze the bulb with your left hand now, please. Squeeze it firmly. That's fine. Now once more. What I want is a man who's as strong as me, but I haven't managed to find one. Squeeze with all your strength now. I tried plenty of men. Oh, my. Six. But none of them could take it. They weren't strong. Let go. Let go. Well, you're strong, Mrs. Murray. Fresh blood for the vampires. In two above average endurance. I've seen him before. According to the file, he took part in a study of antidepressants. Mm-hmm. I remember. He never made it to phase one. Number three is impressive. Scored perfect on the acuity test. Perfect? His powers of concentration are extraordinary. But his character is less inspiring. He's antisocial, undisciplined, he questions authority, a dreamer. Could be interesting. Nobody has ever scored perfect before. Lou, what a name. Have his file run through the computer today. He could be the one. I wonder if we could push him straight into phase two. You've told me very little about phase two. But from what I have seen, there's too much we don't know to support your theory, Doctor. The unknown's always part of research. Of course. But if you just tell me more about your work, I could help you more. There's work to be done. One buck! Another buck! Another buck! <laughs>
Tell me, Lou, did you know that girl yesterday? No. Didn't have time to meet her either. At least we managed to help her. Huh? Reminds me of a girl I knew in France. She used to love to help people, that one. She was one of a kind. Hmm? Went to pick grapes with her one time, but a big storm came up. Hey, you call this rain? Hey! <coughs> Do you call this rain? I didn't say a word. Well, that day it rained so hard, Bozo, we had to go grape fishing. <laughs> we ended up in Paris without a goddamn cent to our name. And Paris is expensive, especially when you're broke. Must be. Good thing I had her. What was her name again? Damn it. Seems to me she wasn't French last time round. Of course she was French. Hey, Bozo, I ought to know that much. Monica. Monica. Anyway. Ah, La France, Bozo. I'll have to take you there someday. <laughs> the Riviera, the beaches, and the wine. All kinds. Red, white, you name it. There's no kind of wine you can't get there. Well, for now, just just try some of this. It's not bad either. Sure, what the Here. hell? Hit me. There. Hey, whoa, whoa. Lou, like a shot? Sorry, can't, Bozo. Huh? Ah, sure you can. Take it. No, really, I have another blood test tomorrow. Huh? A blood test? You got something? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> Who was it? Nobody. He gave it to himself. <laughs> what an acrobat. <laughs> it doesn't look like much, but he's special. It's just part of the deal with this research center. They'll pay me for testing new pills. Huh? That true? Mm-hmm. <gasps> Whatever it takes to buy those new boots, huh? Yeah, but not as good. Know much a pair of these are worth? The kid's right. Your feet are important. How much more do you need? Come on. Give me a number. Six, seven, eight bucks, you name it. I'm short 40 bucks. <laughs> Who makes them? Chanel or someone? Come on, Bozo. Get out your cash. Huh? Let's go, money. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't wear Chanel's, do I? Hey, we're a team, it, guys. Keep no, your money. We're a team. Life. A team's a team and a team sticks together. Come Look, on, Steve, no, it's, it's not like I... You shouldn't throw money around. Do Take I can't I throw my money around? It's just no. a bloody loan. I'm not giving it to you. Will no, you cut off? I should have mentioned I'm sorry, it. Steve. I'll lend money for sneakers, but not for boots. Uh, don't be Okay, boys, I've told you before about using your keys without permission. Have you all got amnesia or what? Christ, boss. You're in a mood this morning. Something's wrong? Yeah. You're flooded. You're flooded. Yeah. Yep, he flooded it. Boys, I won't be getting the run on St. Joseph. After three years of trying. The best run in our area, boys. A major artery, packed with apartments and modest family dwellings, with easy to reach front porches. I could have made a killing, boys. Big money. I thought I deserved it, too. Oh, it's a crummy world. Loyalty used to exist. Not anymore. I mean it, boys. Come on now. A crummy, crummy Come world. On now, boss, a crummy boss, world. Boss, boss, You're boss, the boss, best boss, boss, boss. Here, this'll pick you up. Don't quit on the system, boss. It'll work out. I've already quit. Egg. What was that? A Calypso Trio special. It's some vodka, some southern comfort, uh, some brandy, uh, some banana cream cocktail, a drop of creme de menthe the green, and some schnapps if you want, but by then it won't make much difference. Hey, your song, Bozo. Well, turn it up. Let's hear okay. it. Pepito mi corazón, pepito, pepito, pepito mi corazón, pepito, pepito.
have enough here to keep us going till the year 2000. Speak for yourself. I'll be off touring space by that time. What you doing, Bozo? By God, you're dumb. Load up in front first, not in back. I am loading up in front, see? Not in front of your body, in front of the truck. Ah, there you mean. That's the front of the truck, boss. I know. Load it up first, all right? All right, okay. I put these back there. No, up there, not back there. Uh, hold it, Bozo. Hey, boss, I've been thinking. This is your job. It wasn't our fault if the Lotus shift was over because you slept in. Yeah. Yeah, okay. How about lunch at Sammy's on me, then? Now you're talking, boss. What a boss, boss. Move to the front, bozo. The front back there? <laughs> Catch. Now, oh, where's the kid gone? <laughs> Imagine, Bozo, what if this was money we were loading instead of flyers, huh? Just think, yen and Deutsche Marks and French francs, Canadian dollars, American dollars. What would you do with all that money? Move my whole room to Miami. A river of money, Bozo, a sea of cold cash. Would buy a two-seater rocket, Bozo. <sighs> Plus a swanky condo out in the Milky Way. Huh, Bozo? I suppose. Taking over my head. I dream of it at night. I feel it everywhere. My clothes stink of paper. I gotta quit. Find something new. Hold on. Easy now. Don't be discouraged. It'll pass. Huh? Guys, Lou, Steve. Huh? Let's get some air, Lou. Come on. Yeah, let's go. What are you doing? We're late. It's time to go and start the job. Want to be at Sammy's at noon? Come on. Come on, Ken. Sure, I finished the whole picture. Why not? Uh, one more won't hurt. You're thirsty, huh? Must be. I don't call that thirsty. I call that desperate. Pat, a picture here. Another, Pat. Hey, hold on. That's just one more, Pat. Oh, yeah, just one. Kid, what's with you today? Oh, lick off him, boss. He feels bad. If you ask me, he always feels bad. Christ, boss. At his age, it doesn't make sense. The sky's the limit. Maybe in your day, the sky was the limit. Not in mine. My God, kids are pessimists. Think positive, kid. Think positive. You open your eyes. It's true. The machine's out of control. It's too big, it's gonna blow. And no one can stop it. I'm no pessimist, I'm a realist. You're a realist who feels bad. It's the system's fault, that's what we have to change. Ah. It's too late for that. We gotta change the power base. Start from zero. Hey, whoa, that's where I started from. On the street, handing out flyers. I got a truck today. That better not blow, I worked too hard. Ah. <laughs> Okay, I'm the boss. 
One for Steve. Ah, great. There. Thanks, boss. Well, anyways, I know I'm gonna die young. And I won't be alone either. Great. Now I'm starting to feel bad. Like a chaser, Steve? No, not just now, not just now. I'm having one. If I had the cash, I'd be gone. That's what I did when I was young. I traveled. Go around the world. Did you ever go to Miami? Sure. I'd go to my island. Go. Is this place a hospital or a bank? They're to discourage industrial espionage. Our conglomerate is owned privately. Our task is to develop the cures of tomorrow. By helping us, you'll contribute to scientific progress and the easing of human suffering. At the moment, we're working on the cold. But I've never had one. No matter. Tomorrow, we'll inject the virus. And then, we'll begin the treatment. It's possible the medicine we give you will provoke minor side effects. Dizziness, headaches. You feel up to it? How much you paying? Two hundred dollars. Per day? Per week, with room and board. You'd be here for three weeks. I thought it would be higher. With all the money those pills make you, it sounds like a ripoff. Wait, there is another program. What's it worth? A thousand dollars a week. But at that price, you'll be sick. You'll have pain, diarrhea. You could hallucinate. You'll be kept under observation 24 hours a day. That bad, huh? Fifteen hundred. Done. The contract. Sign at the bottom. The treatment begins noon tomorrow. Oh, we can begin right away if you want. Take some time to think before you sign. Have to tell your parents and your friends? What parents? I'm on my own. No one will miss me. You're risking your neck. You know that. Yes, I know that. He's perfect. Come on. This is it. That's Jimmy. Two occupants a room, he's your roommate. You take a shower, and you then put on your antibacterial uniform and boots. You then throw all your street clothes into the chute. All of them. Your bag. I want to keep my boots. That all right? Why not? But you can't wear them in here. 
Let's see now. If you need anything, you press this button here, which belongs up here. <sighs> Honestly. <sighs> I'll come fetch you in an hour. Is this your first time here? It's my third. And my last. This testing stuff doesn't agree with me. This is the Great Hall. We're in the center's old wing. It's a massive complex. But I prefer it here. I can work in privacy. Is everybody here for the coal? No, we test a whole spectrum of drugs for the market. Lots of old people. I'm researching how age affects brain functions because I'm working on a system to help patients learn to cure themselves. That's the program you're in. You're with me. But how can patients cure themselves? With their brain. A newborn infant uses only 2 or 3 percent of his brain. And even after he's grown old, just 12 percent maximum. If I can activate the part of the brain that's dormant, bring it round, think what we could achieve. There's no limit. Hmm. That's some dream. Yes. Time for your nap, Mrs. Murray. Don't want one. I want people. I want out of here. It smells bad. All lab smell. No. This one smells of death. I'm so sick. My skull feels too small. We've got a shot for that. It'll stop the pain. You'll be just fine. Sick of your damn shots. And of having to be here. You still think you're being kept against your will? Is it a shooting pain? Don't make me die alone here. Let me die. Die in a real oh, home. Easy now. In a uh, real bed. You'll feel better after you've had Surrounded your Surrounded by Come loved on ones. Now. I've Quickly. fed up with Just being take old. Off. I don't want to be anymore. I don't want to be old. Outbursts happen. And she still has the strength to do it. She's outlived her usefulness. Give up on her. She's become uncontrollable. How long have you had her for? I looked for a file, but... And her eyes, the way she looked at me. She wants revenge. She's perfectly aware of what she tried to do to me. I doubt that. Still, her outburst proves one thing. That maybe we're on the wrong track. I'll make some adjustments. May I remind you that we make an excellent remedy for tobacco addiction? It relaxes me. Oh, really? I want to die at home in my own bed. You're better off here, Mrs. Murray. Ah, oh, here time's mixed up. It seems like I've spent 5,000 years in this place. It's a different world. The dead will rise. Evildoers will have to go to a special place. The good will have their own special place. Where we'll each have 
homes of our own. And we'll have peace there. And love in homes of our own. Home, homes of our own. They've nearly cured me. I guess I'll be leaving soon. Can't wait. Probably have to go back on unemployment, but can't win them all. <coughs> Could you do me a favor? Cash this for me? What? Why are you getting so much? That's big money. Give half to my landlord to cover what I owe him, and then... Uh, let's say 200 of my friends, Steve, the rest is yours, okay? Huh. Jesus, what'd they give you? Don't know, but I'm starting to feel it. Here's the addresses. <coughs> I want to die at home, that's all. In my own bed. Surrounded by loved ones. Papa told me bedtime stories, and once I asked him for the moon, the real one. Know what he told me? He told me he'd get it, just for me. It was nice to meet you. If you ever wanted to come and visit, I'm in room 20. That's the age of my last lover. He called me Hope. Hope. Whatever they gave her, she's got it all right. She's wonderful. of the kid. He must have finished his tests. After he plays them, then... Boss, Bozo, Lou, and me are a team. Like in hockey. Left wing, center, right wing, that's how it works. The kid'll come back. Still, it's a three-man team. You two and one more. Three guys. Three guys? That reminds me of the one about the three guys stranded on a desert island. Heard that one, boss? About three guys stranded on a desert island? Can't say I have, Bozo. These three guys are stranded on a desert island. There's a French guy, an American, and a new thief. Anyway, they're real depressed. Then one day they find this magic lamp with a genie. But he gives them each just one wish, only one. The French guy says, I want to go back to France. Mm -hmm. He disappears. The American wants to go home, and mm -hmm. he disappears. The new thief says, I'm lonely. Bring back the other two. <laughs> I'm lonely, he says, bring back the other two. <laughs> oh boy, I love that one. <laughs> I'm lonely. <laughs> um.
Lou, I know you're awake. It's tomorrow morning. You mustn't worry. I'll be with you. Do you trust me? Test 57, brain activation. Status? Reduced muscular resistance. Increased adrenaline. Neurography stable. More than 10% of cells active. He will be in blue phase soon. Subject ready. Pulse 48. Lou, it's me. It's me, can you hear me? You're all right? All right. Please tell me your age. 20. Fine. Listen to me. You're now 40. Twice that age. How old are you? Brain activity increasing. 40. Left hemisphere, 14% active. Right hemisphere, 17. Now you're 80. You are 80. Is brain activity increasing? Yes, 1625. 80. I'm, I'm, I'm 80. Acid level rising sharply. It works, Lucas. It works. Cell activity rising. Ninety. A hundred. How old? Blood profile deteriorating. How old are you now, Lou? Pulse, 27. Pulse, 25. 100. Pulse, 33. He can barely speak. Status report? Hard to say. The computer's having trouble tracking him. Pulse 21. 85% active right side. Left side stable at 47%. Can we tell what he's saying? The decoder can't follow. It's... Computer central. Access it. I have it. Mountains under a glacier. We found it. I knew this place existed. Making our way into the glacier. Right side stable. It's up to 72 on the left side. There's a tropical sea under the ice, and in the middle, there's an island. We've established our settlement. We have sent our children to search the continents for survivors. This place had to exist. If not, why were we allowed to survive till now? Lou, tell me where you are. It's very important. Where are you? It's my time now. I can die. Only be free. Tell me more. Tell me more.
his heart stop beating. Generators, quick! Twelve. It's beating again. Sixteen. We did it. We achieved maximum brain activity. Plus, now I know where I went wrong in the past. I always thought intelligence was the key. No. Look, at first, both sides climbed equally. But then we saw the right side forge ahead. The imaginary dominates the rational. He even managed to create a new reality and show it to me. He envisioned images from his imagination that I could see. From now on, I won't work with adults. I've got to start work with those whose imaginations remain completely uninhibited. That's the key, Mireille. The imagination. I've got to work with children. But they might be blocked as well. Right. Then I'll start working with infants. The imagination in its purest form. That is the soul. He sent that for me before he blacked out. What? The computer generated that image. No. Blue sent that. He let us photograph his soul. But I, I still feel sick. I'm not supposed to go till Friday. These will fix you up. Pink capsule with your meals, green when you go to bed. What's with Lou? He looks pretty bad. He'll be fine. Here, your last check. See ya, Lou. Good luck. I've got this for you from Lou. Lou? Listen, all we want... Why don't you let us in? We won't be long. Right. We just want to talk to him. Sorry. Uh, I can't do it. it but Look, we... I'm not leaving till I see him, understand? <laughs> Nobody's allowed visitors for the moment. Not for another week. My friend, this is Steve. When he says he won't leave, leave he won't. No, sir. So do yourself a favor and just let him in. Steve might not leave, but I guarantee, get in, he won't. <laughs> yeah. Come. Come on. Sure, but Steve. What? Steve. Central. Yeah. How about that guy? Was he in your dream? That was not a dream, Bozo. That was a nightmare. And I've had it twice now, and I've never had nightmares before. I know something's wrong. And it's not even just me. Jimmy, Lou's roommate, he's worried about him. Come on, guys. We've got flyers to hand out. Time is money. Remember that, boys. Time is money. Bozo. Huh? I've got an idea. An idea? Yep. An idea. You 
sure about this, Steve? I hate to think what the boss will say when he finds a note instead of his truck. Quick, open the door, Bozo. Good. That's our way in. Careful, it's fragile. Bozo, it's fragile, I said. Now, let me check Jimmy's map. Goes this way. What's that? It's a lifesaver. I found it in the pedalo. Why do you want it? Because a storm could come and you know I can't swim. The water's not deep, for God's sake. Doesn't look it. Still, I feel more secure with it. Give me that. <laughs> okay. Now listen, Bozo, carefully. Right. Okay? You with me? Well, I'm with you. Good. After we're in. Right. If we're separated. Separated, huh? right. Now we're not going to be, but if... Just if we are. Okay. After ten minutes, we come back to the truck. Okay. If the other one's not there, we don't wait. No, no. no. We drive right back to town. Okay. Tomorrow morning at seven. If one is still missing, well, uh, the other one phones the police. You got that? If one's still missing, am I phoning the police? No. I said the other one phones the police. Ah, so you'll phone the police. No. Look, it's whoever isn't missing, okay? The other one phones the police. Yeah, well, that, that's right. That's what I meant. You're the one that phones if you're the one who's the other one. That's easy. And I phone if I'm the other one. That's what I said. That's what you said. That's it. Come on, let's get it in the water. Careful now. Okay. Down there. Be careful. It's fragile. Oops. Are you trying to break it? It's slippery. I know it's slippery, but you don't have to break it. Wait, wait. Oh, Christ. Go on. Go on. Take the other end. Okay, okay. Go on. It's slippery. Good. Now push gently. <coughs> gently, I said. <laughs> I've just received your report. Can we hope to salvage anything from her program? No. I couldn't see what she claimed to see. Her conclusions are irrational and unverifiable. In other words, she's out of control. Exactly. She's lost touch with reality. Plus, I've detected glaring weaknesses in her methods. I'm listening. I can't specify. I don't have access to her personal files. Now you do. You're now my head of operations for the department. Stop whatever testing is still going on and move all of the subjects out. You have three days to wipe out every trace of her program. It never happened. And as for Lucas, leave her to me. I'll get there as soon as possible. I know I can depend on you, Mireille. The board does too. So, do what has to be done. Me, we're not even moving. Darn thing's hopeless. It wasn't built for racing, Bozo. No kidding. We'll get there. A pedalo is... It's not made for going somewhere. A pedalo is for when you want to paddle around the lake. With your wife. When the moon is out. <laughs> True. <laughs> oh, That's boy. what they're for. <laughs> hey, when I tell people about this, they won't believe a word. Bozo, know something? Doesn't matter if a story's true or not. It's how you tell it that matters. That's what counts. Go ask your wife. I bet she'd believe me. Huh? You heard me. Go ask your wife. I'll do that. Follow evacuation procedure code 101. I repeat, all level A and B technicians. Follow evacuation procedure code 101. All nurses, test block C and D, assemble all designated test subjects for immediate use. Repeat, nurses in 
test block C and D. Assemble dedicated detection subject. Are you scared? Look, it's a secret. If they found this, there'd be trouble. One of my first lovers got me it. See that? That's me, but don't tell anyone. There'd be trouble. I was pretty, wasn't I? <gasps> That's you? It's all I've got left. Time went so fast. She's not scheduled for a release tonight. So back to her room, clear the hall. As for you, you're to be examined. No! Hey, easy now, easy! dragon before it swallows us all. I saw where your work led. Never more. Lou, please wait. There's no need to fear my work. And if we're to learn all we can, we have to go on. Just think, if we could pass on all our knowledge to our children at birth, they'd have their entire lives to improve the world. Improve mankind, make ourselves better, perfect, a new race. If you help, I know we can do it.
I'll handle this, Mireille. I want her locked up. I'm in charge. Search the area. Don't make things difficult. Where is he? Take her away. You deserve better than that. Spit it out, come on. I made her up. What? I'm not married. Huh? I don't have a wife. Bozo, you're joking. 
You must be joking. I mean, my God. Uh, are oh you my really God. surprised? Are you kidding? Oh, hey, Bozo, I wouldn't stand here and lie to you. Surprised? I'm shocked. Yes, yeah, so you you thought uh, you really I thought so, you yeah. had a wife then? I believed it. Really? Yeah, I believed it. Hey, I mean, I mean, it really? got me all the way. For a moment out on the pedal, well, I thought. Oh, no, 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 you got me. I was sure yeah, you, you got me. Out. No, I believed it, Bozo. <laughs> Bozo, I believed it. <laughs> Look, Bozo, we have to get going, all right? Huh? Right. You're going to be a hero, Bozo. I suppose. But I'm not sure that I want to be. Let's find the kid. Look at the sign. Gallery 32. Hey, we're going the right way for sure. Look at this. See? I suppose. No, not up there. The way out should be on this level. What a place. I'll say one thing for him. It ain't small. Christ. A door, that must be it. Bozo. Bozo? What are you doing? Get in there! Good, it's the Great Hall. We're almost there. We've been almost there all night. Over there. Okay, Bozo. 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 Listen, I'm one of his friends. Don't be afraid. Lou, which room is he in? I've got to get Lou. Lou? Lou, where is he? Lou? Right. They took him away. I don't know where. Same as all my lovers. He won't come back. A 
friend, you said? Yes. Do you know where they took him? He won't come back like all the others they never do. I try, but I'm too strong for them. <laughs> I'm scared, old boy. It's the wrong room, Bozo. Come and look at the map. Is this room near here? I'm not sure. Well, I hope the map fight will be here forever. Let me see. I've got an idea. Hey, let's come God, back later. God, there are demons in my room. Where? Here. They're oh, right no. here in my room. No, we got to get out of here. There are demons here. we got to get out of here. I'm going, I'm going. Open it. I can't. It's locked. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Come on. How about these things again, the old bat? Steve, 
They're all old folks. Yeah. His hands. Look at them. They look so young. I told you something was going on. Luke would be in here. Are you thinking what I am, Steve? Isn't this an awful thing to do? Huh? It's not human stealing their lives like this. We can't just leave them here, Steve. Huh? What will we do? Shh. Oh, what will we do? Shh. I hear something. Where are you taking me? What is all this? What? No Hurry up, Bozo. We gotta hide! Zed! Oh, it's putrid here. What's the meaning of this? You never told us there were so many. Guinea pigs. Over the past three years, she's used 50 of them. Files were falsified to show they left after three weeks. But they were brought down here, left to rot. No family, no fixed address. Nobody to ask any questions. Nobody to help them. They're mine. Dispose of these purulent vegetables and the vermin they attracted once. They're revolting. Let me finish my work. I'll make them young again. I can, I'm sure I can. You lied to me. Betrayed me at every turn, but it won't happen again. You thought only of your work, you selfish creature. How dare you? How dare you? And just look at your results. Know what you're worth to me now? Even less than one of your corpses. We still eliminate artists, geniuses, and dreamers. In the end, they only create chaos and disorder. If you're not a good prayer, Bozo, you'd better say it. Because I've got a bad feeling that we just bought the farm. So long, Bozo. 
So long, Steve. Come on, we'll bust some heads first. Hail Mary, full of grace for what we are about to receive. Bozo. Amen. Forget it, Bozo. We must be dead already. Hello, boys. How you been? Hope, these are my friends, Steve and Bozo. Hey, Bozo, if you wake up before I wake up, wake me up too, will you? It, it's Blue. He's got his Chanel. See? Oh, my God. They, they got you too. And now they're after us. Blue, think we should go and talk later, dear? Oh, yes, absolutely. He knows the way out. Give me your hands and he'll lead us. He can see in the dark. After the lights are out. my home. My island. Oh, my planet. My wife. a trip around the world. I'll find a freighter. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> 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 